Hey, what's up everybody? My name is Trevor and today I'm going to be teaching you how to play Steel and Blood by Minus the Bear. It is a very simple song on guitar, so I hope you guys stick with me throughout the video and remember to subscribe to my channel. Thanks! <laughs> Alright, so um, that, what I just played there is going to be the majority of this song. Um, parts of it are played a little bit differently, but that is kind of what's going on here. So, uh, let's get started. So we've got the first finger on the fifth string, sixth fret, and then we're going to play this droning open sixth string. So we start off with something really dissonant right here. And then we just add the second finger onto the seventh fret of the fifth string. And then we're gonna scoot that down two frets and use the third finger on the sixth. So we're gonna do four and six. So. And then scoot it down two more frets and two and four. And then scoot it down to one. So we've got six, seven, four, six, two, four, one. So. Okay, um, and then the part after that is going to be the same notes, but just an octave higher. So literally just play everything the same on the fifth string, except shift everything up 12 frets. So now we're going to be up here on... So rather than kind of like the... We're kind of doing a... So what I'm doing there is I'm palm muting first, oh, first off, and then I'm alternating between the 6th and 5th strings. And so I'm going down on the 6th and up on the 5th, so... Okay, and then yeah, on, on certain ones you're just going to bend it instead of playing two. Um, and then it goes back into the... And then it's going to go into the chorus, which uh, is going to start on just an open E chord. So for those of you that don't know, it's going to be uh, second fret on the fifth string, second fret on the fourth string, first fret on the third string. And everything else is open, so we're going to start off with that. And then we're going to go to a, uh, a flat minor or G sharp minor. Up here. So that's going to be, a, um, you're going to bar all six strings on the fourth fret, and then you're going to have um, your third finger on the sixth fret, fifth string, and your pinky on the sixth fret, fourth string. <laughs> So it goes from E to G sharp minor to B. So the B major is just barring the second fret from five down and then barring with your third finger or you could play it like this. So you got those three notes on the fourth fret. So that's the chorus. So um, a few more beats for the E than for the other two chords, um, but yeah, that's the chorus. And then I don't know if you would call this part a solo, but it's kind of as close as you're going to get to a solo in this song, so um, it's going to do some random notes, um, and then it goes into a couple different licks. So the first lick is going to be like that. 
So to play that, we're going to start on the third string, 13th fret, and hammer to 15. And then we're going to go up to the second fing or second string and do the 12th fret. And then back down to third string, 15th fret, and then 11. And then back up to the second string and do 14. And then back down to the third string. He plays that like three times and then he's gonna just go to the the next two strings down and he's gonna be on the second string hammering on these notes but he's already gonna have his first finger set on the first string 12th fret and you got your second finger on the uh, 14th fret of the second string and then you can hammer on either your pinky or your third finger I like to do my third finger in this case um, on to the 16th fret of the second string so so notice how the note on the second note on the second string is bleeding into that note on the first string and it's really dissonant and that's kind of what we're going for here is And then the part after that is just going to be all on the 6th string and it's going to start off open. So open to 11. So the second half of that riff is 2 and then 4, 6, 7. So 0, 11, um, and then 2, four, six, seven, so. All right, so once again, two opens. Three notes on 11, and then we're gonna do a quick down up, and then two, second fret on the sixth string, four, six, seven. So that's it for this one. Like I said, really easy song, so I hope you guys are able to jam along with it um, and have fun with it. Leave me a comment in the comment section with any questions you guys have or any feedback on, and remember to subscribe to my channel. Alright, have a good one guys.